through me to Kano. So your girl has gone through all the stage, stages of grief. Ah, what you get with Hey! Oh my god. Hmm. Hey god. Cried, acceptance, rejecting, denial, everything. And I'm not yet at accepting it so but I have to move. So today is Saturday and I'm currently in Delta State, so I'm going to board a train from Delta to Abuja and then from Abuja to Kano. So yeah guys, I'm going to vlog and take you guys with me on my journey to the Nigerian Law School, Kano Bagada Campus. So we'll get some cash because they said that there's no ATM um, machines at the Bagada Campus and withdrawing money is a bit of a hassle. So I want to just like get enough cash for my journey and maybe some extra and all of that. So I arrived at Abuja late in the evening and I had to lodge in a hotel that was close to the train station which I was going to board to Kano. My journey, I realized that I'd not even gotten to Kano but my cash was already like half gone. I woke up very early the next morning and it actually actually dawned on me that I was posted to Kano. I went to the train station, I boarded and then we got to Kaduna and then from Kaduna we had to take a car to the Bagauda campus. On my way I didn't even know what to think, what to feel, how to feel. I was just blank. I was just blank. I was thinking about everything else but like what was going to happen or where I was going to. The emotion starts coming back when I saw the signboard Nigerian Law School Kano Campus. <laughs> And yes, I just kept thinking, yes. is this where I'm supposed to be in? Is this where I'm supposed to live? Is this where I'm supposed to stay in the for middle of a whole nowhere. nine months? Nowhere. I was trying to be positive, but that positivity came crashing down when we were stopped at the gate and told that no cars could enter. So we had to pay um, trucks, like wheel trucks, to take our luggage into the campus. Anyways, I guess because of the company I had, I felt it too better and I just um, started catching crews because that was like my coping mechanism. I started um, familiarizing myself with the guys that were carrying our load and then um, I introduced myself as Hadiza. <laughs> I suddenly adopted a northern name and yeah that was basically it so this is Mustafa that is Amil this is who okay <laughs> okay and I am Hadiza <laughs> I am Hadiza. This is my friend Mustafa. This is Amil and this is Boba. Yeah, there are a lot of things that I was told about the Kano campus Bagauda before coming that upon arrival here I found out not to be true. And then there were some things that I was told about the campus that on arrival here it was extremely true. Um, one of it will be like the cold weather. The weather is is cold, it's so cold, like freezing cold. So the next day, after um, after registration, I went to Mami Market to like find something to eat. So that whole plate of food cost five hundred naira with a maggi cubed meat. <laughs> And when a lot of people mentioned, oh, the weather is cold, I thought it was like normal cold. But this one is like almost winter weather. But after um, the first 
one week, I guess. I started getting used to it and it became better because the school provided like hot water for us to take our baths before going to class. So this vlog is just basically about me finding my way to the Bakauda um, campus Kanu and it to like proper northern state in Nigeria. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog even though I didn't talk much, you didn't see my face much. In fact, I was contemplating whether to vlog or not. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog.